Hi everybody. I just wanted to show you how to add the Bitmoji extension to your Google Chrome. So the first thing that you need to do um, is you are going to come up here to apps. You're going to click on this. Um, you need to get the Bitmoji extension. So you're going to go to the web store down here in the bottom right corner. You're going to click on web store. This is where you get, you can even buy, but I wouldn't buy anything, get the free ones, your extensions, and then you can also do themes, but I'll show you that in another video. Click on extensions, and then you should be able to search the store. Um, so you're going to type in Bitmoji, and here's the Bitmoji extension. Mine says rate it right here. Let me move my video from myself. It should say add to Chrome. Once it does that, it's going to pop up right here. Okay? Um, you have to have created a Bitmoji account for yourself by going to www.bitmoji.com. Or you can download the app to create your account. And that's where you're going to create your little person. You have to have done that before you do this. Once you have done this and you want to use it at school, you need to override the security on the system. So you do teacher.carrollcountyschools.com. You override with your regular old username and password. And once you've done that, then your Bitmoji extension should work and your little Bitmoji should pop up. So Bitmojis on your, your Chrome are really good for things like Word. So if you open up a new Word doc, it's good for Word, it's good for um, slides to add a Bitmoji to a new Word doc. You're going to, um, let me open up a new Word doc. While I'm doing that, I'm going to find what Bitmoji I want to put in there. So maybe it's, um, you want like books. Here's my little Bitmoji girl. You click on her and you can drag her in. You drag and drop your Bitmojis. If you wait for it, she'll pop up. It just takes a minute. And then you can manipulate her into whatever you need, however big you need it. I like to um, crop my Bitmojis because there's a lot of white space right here. So you can crop her so that you have more space um, to throw in your text. So that's where the cropping tool is. And then you can make her bigger, make her smaller, whatever you need to do. If you need her to fit in with your text beside it, um, you'll need to wrap the text. If you need to fit her in between the text, um, here I'll show you. Big pen is really cool. If I knew I was still cool. So my favorite font is Frederica the Great. I love big font. And I want her to be on the other side of that text. I need to wrap my text so that she goes on that side. But if you break the text, it could go in between. And that's not really, that's not good. Okay, that's how you make your, that's how you add Bitmoji to your extension. This, these are all my little extensions up here. Bitmoji is just one of them. And how you add it into a Google Doc, you can do the same with Google Slides. And I hope that helps. Bye!